Yo, what's happening, YouTube? This is your man, Paul Radio Man 2094 here, back in with another video as usual. Today, we're going to make this video as quick as possible, but we're going to recap of the three cases that I got and covered on my Samsung Galaxy A11 so far. Like the, re the recaps from uh, the unboxing and first impressions, the recap from the full review, and then I got a new one today from Cricut Wireless. But we'll we'll show all three. So let's start off with like the cheapest all the way to the expensive. So stand by real quick, and all the prices are going to run you 488 to 16 bucks. But on the 16 dollar part, I'll uh. I'll mention that here in a moment too. So let's get right into the video. So stand by. Be right back. All right. So we're recapping from the unboxing and first impressions. I did the on gel skin case. This one's going to run you 488 at Walmart. Here's all, everything how it looks. All your cutouts line up. Even on your headphone jack, your mic, your speaker grill, your mic on the bottom, your USB Type-C port, and then your outside buttons and stuff. This is one of the reasons why I didn't like this case because of that reason, but since I got this new phone and I'm using it as my daily phone for right now, I have to do what I got to do, so I had to buy a case. So, yeah, this is the first one I started off with. Of course, everything works. All the buttons work. You know, you get the idea. Oh, and then just for the hell of it, we'll do the fingerprint sensor. And that works with no problems. And then charging, everything works to this case. But, all right. Let's keep on going. Let's uh, recap from the uh, full review that I did. The case I did on the full review, excuse me. All right, stand by. All right, so now let's recap from Incipio. We got the Dual Pro Classic. I covered this one on my full review. This one's going to run you 13 bucks at Walmart. And I think on Amazon too, but if I find a link, I'll leave that up in the description as well. But yeah, this one's going to run you 13 bucks. But of course... I've been using this case for a while now. This is like one of my favorite cases that I've owned so far. Of course, you got the the fingerprint sensor deep in there and stuff. And then all your buttons are here. And then you got the buttons. That's the reason why I like this one opposed to this one right here. And then your headphone jack. Everything is all lined up. And of course, you know, charging works, blah, blah, blah. But yeah, 13 bucks at Walmart for the Incipio Dual Pro. This is one of my favorite cases, and in case if you guys don't follow me on Instagram, I know some of you do, some of you don't, but what was it, a couple weeks ago, I drew a, I dropped this phone, like face down, like, like in this part, and then here's the scratch from it, but yeah, it passed the drop test with flying colors, of course you see a little bit of wear in the case and stuff, but yeah, this is definitely a good case, so, and then 10 feet drop tested. So yeah, they weren't lying about that. But yeah, and of course, all your buttons and everything lines up as well. And of course, your fingerprint sensor. But yeah, this is one of my new favorite cases that I've owned so far. But all right, now let's take it over to the new one that I bought. I already unboxed it and stuff. I got it over at Cricut Well, so let's take a look at it real quick. So stand by. All right, so I got a new one from Cricut Well today. It's already out of the package because they took it out of the package for me, but that's cool though. But yeah, this one's going to run you. Well, the normal price for the Cricut Well's cases, because this is like the branded case right here. Of course, you could tell by the design, the matte finish and stuff. But yeah, this one's going to run you 20 bucks normal price, but I got my receipt right here. Look at how much savings that I've saved up. So it would be 25, but I got the discount for 5 bucks, sales tax, 
And of course, like it came out to 15 bucks, but after taxes, it came out to 16.24. So I got a little discount with this. But shout out to the homies over at Cricket Wireless for helping me out with this. But yeah. But all right, let's take a look at the case. This is a two-part style case, though. You got a matte finish on the on the case, which I like. And of course, you could separate it if you want. That's the same thing with the Incipio Dual Pro case. You could separate that too, but you don't have to. But of course, here's all your buttons and then your cutouts. And then your cutouts on the top, cutout for the camera, and then your fingerprint sensor, and then you also got a kickstand. So let's slap it on the, uh, let's take our time with this one though. So let's uh, take the back off real quick. And then let me make sure my phone's all polished off real quick. So I could put it in and stuff. You know what I mean? Yeah, I mean from a uh, scary movie. Yeah. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. But, all right, we got this part in. And then we got the, we're going to put the back part on right now. Of course. And, of course, here's everything right here. And as you see, all the cutouts line up. Like you see, here's your power button, your volume up and down. And then your camera's all nice and flushed. Same thing with uh, the Incipio Dual Pro case. And then your headphone jacks flushed out too. Yeah, this is a cool case. And of course, you got your fingerprint sensor cut out. So let's check fingerprint sensor real quick and we'll check the buttons. Okay, that works with no issues. And let's check if you could still scroll down. I'll always love this feature on my phone. And then let's check volume up and down. Okay, that works with no issues at all. But yeah, all your buttons work out flawlessly. And of course you got your kickstand. So let me pull up a video real quick so we could do a demonstration on how you're going to watch your video on YouTube. So stand by. All right, so this is gonna be how the kick sound would look. You just like use your nail just to pop that out. Set it up on the table, watch your content. Let me turn off the flash so you guys can get a demonstration. You know, Samsung earbuds. Full screen. And I did this review a couple days ago. So we're gonna pull this real quick. And then Okay, so yeah, basically you can watch all your content. And of course, like from this angle. But you guys get the idea, though. All right, so let's wrap up the video real quick. Stand by. All right, so as of right now, this is all the cases that I got for my Samsung Galaxy A11. But stay tuned. I got the Zezo Bolt Series case coming in. And then whenever I have the time to save up the money, it's going to be, there's going to be a few more cases coming in. Once I save up the money for it, I'm going to begin some spec cases. I'm going to get some Spigen cases. I got the case from UAG coming in. So I'm going to do another video with all those cases. Oh, yeah, and OtterBox as well. I'm going to get some from OtterBox. And then uh, the defense shield, but it goes by the Raptic shield. But stay tuned for those videos. Once I get all those, I'll... Do it like how I just did it just now. Just recap from the full, the unboxing and first impressions, and then the full review. And then now, I'll do that same recap again, and then I'll check out all the new ones as well. And then I'll be uh, getting some from the, you know, with the Samsung Galaxy Buds I just got. I'm gonna be checking out some cases for these too. So basically, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna combine. All of it into one video so I'll share like some of the cases I got some that I'm gonna be ordering from Spigen and a couple of other companies so yeah I'm just gonna like do a combination video with all of it together but stay tuned for that video but I'll be once I get the Zizzle bolt series case I'll be doing a case video for that and then we'll do the same recap as these two and then the new one but yeah we'll we'll just recap from those and then uh once I get the, like the ones I just mentioned, 
we'll be doing those too. But we'll unpackage those and stuff. But you guys get the drill and stuff. So stay tuned for the for those videos. But anyways, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. So here's me one more time. Stand by. Alright, so like I said, that's all the cases as of right now that I got. But we're just recapping from the ones from the unboxing and first impressions, the full review. And then the new one I got from Cricket Wireless Day. This is going to be my new daily for right now until my Zizzo case comes in. But I'll be doing that video once I get that case. So stay tuned for that one. And then like I said, I'm going to be buying a few more from uh, UAG, Spec, and then uh, Spigen. And then some for the Galaxy Buds like I mentioned. So stay tuned for that video. I'm just going to do a combination video. Just combine them all into one video and then recap like I just did with these ones I just reviewed. So yeah, stay tuned for everything in the video. But like I said, if you guys have questions on anything, if you guys want me to cover some on my channel, hit me up in the comments and then I'll take a look at that later. But anyways guys, on that note, I'm Paul Radio Man 2094 I'm out, yo. Deuces. Thank <laughs> you.